The Ingram Angle spoke with some of those protesters today. Here's what they told us. Out here supporting the Canadian truckers in Ottawa, the Canadian people. It's a peaceful, amazing working class revolution. And I'm just astonished that the legacy left media is not covering at all or acting like this thing is something that it's not. It's multicultural, it's diverse, it has to do with resisting authoritarianism. And Trudeau has shown his true colors. He is clearly a World Economic Forum authoritarian who doesn't care about the people. They have a tyrannical um, leader just like we do. They're really the example that we need to follow right now. What the Canadian truckers are doing is just amazing. It's amazing for all of us, all around the world. Everyone who's affected by the mandates. It's uh, too late to do anything right now. He needs to step down and let someone else um, cover it. But if he's not gonna resign, at least um, end, end the mandates, do what they, do it, a simple thing they're asking. Just end the mandates, that's all we want. And I don't understand. They, it's a, it's a bigger agenda than, than what's being proposed. We're ultimately here for our freedom. This is a war against humanity. It's a spiritual war against humanity. And there are some people who have not bowed down to their authority. If there's any war against humanity, Trudeau just now uh, declared it with his emergency use of just um, using the battlefield of um, economics. He's playing a really dangerous game because ultimately you can't be at war with half the populace and that's what's going on in the U.S. I'm here uh, to support the Canadians. I'm here to support uh, New Yorkers for health choices of their own and um, to support the uh, people that have lost their jobs due to these mandates, which are really unjust. My history of my life, I've never seen anything so absurd. Um, I, I'm just, I'm really, I was really taken aback by it. I can't believe that people are not screaming from the, the, the rooftops for this, because this is just absolutely ridiculous. I was a nurse for 18 years, and I was a very good nurse, and so they decided to terminate me even still, even though I had an excellent record. We're seeing different things like their bank accounts, uh, uh, the, the, the vaccine mandates, the cards, the QR codes, and all of these things. These are not signs of freedoms. These are things that impede upon freedom, right? People need to be given a choice. They need to be allowed to choose rather than have somebody choose for them. I think it's about time that people wake up. I think it's about time that people become awake from being woke. I used to be woke, but now I'm awake. Oh my God, I love her. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.